Well, it wouldn't be December Mesa Morning Live without our friends at Wells Fargo. Uh, Wells Fargo has been our sponsor for many years, and today we've got from Wells Fargo our small business banker, Mr. Alberto hey, Mark, Vasquez. How uh, Alberto, you welcome. You a gift. You brought me a gift? Yeah, for you guys. Oh, uh, wait a minute. You started out as me, and then it turned into you guys. So, well, I don't even know what this is. This normally, is cool. you get the gifts and you give them to charity. Well, that's true. This is the iconic. This Mike. is Mike. I think this is a second appearance at your show. It is. Mike. Mike is a returning guest on Mason Morning Live. Very cool. Tell us a little bit about what's going on at uh, Wells Fargo. Welcome, by the way. This is your first time on. This is my first time on. Is yes. it a dream come true for you? Yes, it is. I finally made it. Yeah. <laughs> well, tell us a little bit about how things are going at uh, Wells Fargo. Um, Wells Fargo right now, we're, we're actually, um, we have a campaign going on. It's nationwide. It started in November and it's going all the way till December. It's called our HOPE campaign. Um, the HOPE campaign is basically supporting this local small businesses and it's making sure that we're coming together to get, to get help and you know, get us back on our feet. And um, one thing that Wells Fargo is doing, that we have a Miracle Mile event, December 18th, and we're getting our hands dirty. We're getting, we're getting with the community. We're helping fixing the locations. We're painting. We're, we're changing light bulbs. We're changing the landscaping. And one thing that we want to let the community know is, during these holidays, shop at your local restaurants. Go to the local toy store. You know, even leave a nice positive review. It goes a long way for our local businesses right now during the pandemic. Absolutely. Well, the pandemic's been tough on uh, businesses large and small, and I know you guys are, uh, are really big in the lending community for small business. Yes, um, during PPP, all the fees accumulated with PPP was, were over in 400 million. What we did, we did a open business fund where we granted over 280,000 small businesses. Well, we kept probably 1.7 million um, workers employed. Wow. Um, locally for, for Mesa, we gave about 1,400 small business loans. We granted probably about 68 million in credit just locally in Mesa. Wow, that's phenomenal. Well, you, you mentioned employees. I know that Wells Fargo is one of the largest employers in the state of Arizona. Uh, your footprint is, is everywhere. Yes, that, that is true. Um, but one thing we're focusing is on the veterans. Um, you know, veterans gave a lot for our, this country. Now it's our turn to serve them. Um, we probably have over 8,000 employees that, that self-identified as veterans. And we want to let them know that we're here, we're care. We have a, a team that literally just helps with counseling and helps um, veterans look for jobs. And as a proud uncle to a, a service member at the moment, and I want to let all the family members know and all the veterans, thank you guys for your services. And we do have a Wells Fargo um, website where you can go for veterans it's just for veterans where we have a lot of resources where we're helping out our, our veterans right now at the moment that's awesome are you based locally in mesa or? yes i am at a location on power mcdowell i'm here for the community i help out with small businesses or big corporations so if you just have a question how to start up a business come see me i'm you can set up an appointment with me and we could talk all day you know even if you identify as a small business Everybody needs a partner, and a good banking partner it truly can determine whether or not you're successful. So, boy, there's no better partner than Wells Fargo. I understand you have a big commute to come to Mesa. Where do you, where yes. do you live? I live in Goodyear. I, I live in Goodyear. I drive about an hour and 15 minutes to get to my local branch. Um, I, I started with Wells Fargo over six years ago, and I started in Mesa. And I said to myself that I'm not, I wasn't going to leave this community just because <laughs> I have small little startups that started at a local restaurant. Now I have customers that have seven, eight restaurants. So I want to stay in the community still. Well, you know, Alberto, there's a lot of great, beautiful homes for sale in Mesa. Well, what the, the way the property, uh, the property value is going up, it's pretty expensive. <laughs> well, there you go. Well, I was going to say, well, then keep driving in from Goodyear. We don't care. Gas is cheap for a guy like you. You probably put it on the on the Wells Fargo uh, gas account. So. Sometimes, if, if I get to. <laughs> That's awesome. So if anybody's got any questions, uh, what's, this, what's the course of action to get to get in touch with you or anybody at Wells Fargo? You could actually use the wellsfargo.com uh, website and look up for appointment, make an appointment with uh, a small business banker. 
or you could call my branch on Power McDowell and just ask for me and we'll set up an appointment. That's awesome. Well, as we mentioned, uh, Wells Fargo sponsors every December at Mason Morning Live. Um, and you do things just every day of the calendar year. So thank you for all you do. Uh, thanks for the little goodies. We'll make sure those get into some good hands. You're welcome. And thanks for being here today. And keep up the good work. If you need a banker, call Wells Fargo. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you, Mark. Good to see you. Happy thank holidays. You. Happy holidays to you, too.